Hi, Ashley here with Heart Hook Home, and today we are learning how to do a Russian join for crocheting and knitting. A Russian join is when you literally take two different pieces of yarn and you hook them together like this so that they do not break, so that it does not come undone. It's a very useful technique when you're changing different skeins of yarn, not necessarily different colors, but different um, skeins like if you're trying or if you're joining a new um, skein for a blanket that you're making. So I have two different colors here so that we can really see what we're doing. First, you wanna make sure that you have a pointy tip needle and we're gonna thread that. And we want it pointy because we're literally going to stab through the center of that yarn. If you look closely at your yarn, you'll notice that it kind of spirals. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go through that spiral straight up the middle of that yarn. Kind of helps if you push down a little bit, it opens up those fibers. Can you see how I'm going straight through the middle? It helps to keep things going as they should. Now I always go at least three inches. Some people will tell you two is enough. I always do three because the farther back you go, the stronger it is. Of course, if you go back too far, it's just overkill. So um, I always just do three or until I feel like I've got enough on the needle. And then we are going to pull this through and then we're gonna do the same exact thing on the other side. Okay, so we've got a, a bit here. Very important to maintain this loop. So what I like to do, hold on, let me grab this. I like to take my other yarn and stick it through the loop and then pull it. And that way I don't lose this. So now we're going to take our yarn needle. We're gonna move all the yarn that we have on there down or off. Okay, so we have our whole entire needle exposed and now we're going to hold on to our other yarn and we're going to pull this tail through over here. Okay, so now we've got all of that blue fed through the center of that yarn. We're going to do the same thing on the other side because this is for the other one, right? For our Russian join. So we will thread that bad boy and we're going to go straight up the middle of this yarn just like we did with the blue. straight through the center of those fibers. Make sure you're getting as center as you can. It's okay if you have to pull it out a little bit and kind of reposition it. And it does help if you are kind of loosey-goosey. If you hold the yarn very tight, it, it makes it a lot harder. So just kind of gently open it up with what I'm using as my left hand. Um, so we make sure we're going straight through those spirals That's probably about enough. See how it's opening up? Love it. Okay, so now we're gonna do the same thing we did on the other side. We're gonna take that and we're gonna pull that down off the end of the needle. And now we're gonna pull the end tail through over here, just like we did with the blue. Boom, nice. So we are almost done. So now we've got these two little loops here. So in order to get these smaller, because we don't wanna be able to see them, we're gonna pull this red Okay, we're gonna pull the tail of that red and it'll kind of cinch it up a little bit. There we go. We're gonna do the same thing on the blue, which it looks like the blue end is already kind of pulled. Let's grab that little tail here and we're gonna pull that. There we go. So now we're gonna pull on both ends Pull a little bit more on that red to get that, there we go, cinched up. And now we're going to trim our ends here. Boop, and over here. Boop, you might have to trim it more than once. It's okay if you do. See, I might, if I, if I were really gonna do a good job on this one, I would trim this a little bit more and I'd trim this a little bit more. But for the, for the all the intents and purposes, we are done. So this is how you do the Russian join. Let's see if we, it's a good one. You hear that? That ain't going nowhere, baby. Beautiful, 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 strong Russian join. So this is a great way to change colors in your yarn. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a few tries and let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.